welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, my name is Gunny, and today we're going to be playing the game called The Space for the Unbound. And I'm really, really excited to be able to sit down and play it and experience the first part of the gameplay with you guys. As you guys may know that I did play the demo. So if you are interested in watching that, it is available on my channel. Just a full disclaimer, the beginning part of this game, it is included in the demo. So I am going to be kind of starting off from where I left off from the demo, if that makes sense. I do want to also have a trigger warning because this game does talk about mental health issues. I don't exactly know where in the game it's going to mention any of that, but I did want to kind of put that in there in this intro just so you are aware. But other than that, enough of me rambling. Let's get into it. So this is pretty much where I left off from the demo. Again, you can go to my channel and look at the demo if you are interested in that short gameplay. But let's see where the story takes me. Wake up, you lazy bum. Oh, where? Where am I? At school, silly. See, I still don't know whether I was actually dreaming or if the experiences in the prologue or in the slash called demo version of the game was actually real events, like in the game, not IRL, but we'll see. School, why am I? Don't tell me you slept so deeply you lost your memories. I, Atma. You still remember who I am, don't you? The girl of my dream. You, who are you? The girl of your dreams. Well, that's why you're dating. Oh, that's his girlfriend. Hey, you're blushing. Hm. It's Raya, you sleepyhead. Look at you forgetting your girlfriend's name right after you've opened your eyes. Never do that again, or I'll get real mad at you. Yes, ma'am. Girlfriend, huh? I'm still so drowsy. That was a really wild dream. <laughs> His face. What time is it? Class is already over. You were having a really good sleep. Was I? I'm so tired. It doesn't feel like sleep. I slept at all. What happened? I had this weird dream. It's haunting me. Weird dream. I hope I wasn't in it. Actually, you were. Your face filled the entire sky. And you had this awful, creepy smile. <laughs> what is that supposed to mean? beats me. Huh. I spend the whole day taking notes in class for you and you call me creepy? That's very rude, you know. You've been taking notes for me? Of course. Here. Aw, so sweet. Whoa, that's so nice of you. Thank you, Raya. <laughs> so cute. What would you do without me, huh? Raya! Mr. Ang uh, um, Agong? I don't know if I said that right. I apologize in advance for all the words that I will mispronounce. If anybody here knows how to pronounce them correctly, please let me know in the comments below because I truly suck at pronouncing words <laughs> and names. Can I help you? You still haven't done your future plan consultation. Oh, right. I'm sorry, sir. Come to the staff room as soon as possible. A model student like yourself shouldn't miss an opportunity to prepare for the future. Right. You haven't done it either, have you, Atma? Haven't what? <laughs> Sigh. Just make sure you two fill out this form. I'll wait for you in the staff room. Will do, sir. Hey, what is that? What is what? What is the future plan consultation? Why 
Why didn't you attend the consultation? Do, am I supposed to choose which answer? I'm supposed. I, I didn't know. I thought this was a continuation of like the speech bubble. Maybe I have to choose what answer. A meeting with seniors have with teachers to discuss what we plan to do after graduation. It's about your grade subjects, the universities we're interested in. Sigh. I'm so in trouble. Why? I don't even know what I'm gonna do tomorrow. How am I supposed to know what to, what to do after I graduate? <laughs> Damn, Atma. What about you? I haven't decided on anything yet. I'm confused. I don't like it when adults involve themselves in my future. Same. Yeah, me neither. They just want to make us into one of them. I want to choose my future, not one the adults would find acceptable or beneficial. The future you're so confused about. Yeah. Ugh, I don't feel like doing it right now. Then what should we do with the form? Hmm, let's see. What if we change this into... This. A bucket list. I like how it says handsome Atma and Raya's epic bucket list. Yes. Write down anything you want to do, even if it's silly. It's planning for the future, right? What should I write? Whatever comes to mind. Hmm. Let me write something first then. Watch a movie. Oh, that's cute. It doesn't matter as long as we go together. Oh, it's a date then. They're so adorable. You bet. It's your turn. What do you want to do? Oh, so, so I do select, I didn't know. <laughs> I think this came up earlier and I like didn't know what it was. So I kind of just chose whatever, but now I know. Collect 20 bottle cups. Pet the fluffiest animal known to man. That is what I'm gonna put on my bucket list. <laughs> what is the fluffiest animal? I'm not sure. Maybe I need to pet all the animals in town to find the fluffiest one. Legend says a fluffosaurus still roams the streets. I think you spend too much time daydreaming, Atma. <clears throat> it's your turn. What's next? Have a pet cat. You like cats, huh? Their fur, their purr, their tiny, tiny, their teeny, tiny paws. Cats are the best. I can purr too if you want. <laughs> I'm gonna pretend I didn't hear that. Write your next one. Collect 20 bottle caps. Beat the future fighter high score. I don't know which one to choose. I would want to do this, but I feel like I'm gonna have to like go to an arcade or something. Um, I'm gonna do bottle caps because I feel like that's the easiest task to do. Only 20? That's not many. Unless maybe they're unique ones. I used to have a collection of my favorite bottle caps. I've lost them and I want to start collecting again. Are they valuable? Well, they're, how do I put it? Sentimental. Over to you. Want to write something else? Hmm, something delicious. You're craving something. Yes, kind of. I want to eat an entire Black Forest Ghetto. Entirely? You know what? I've never had that before. Have you? Let me know. <laughs> entirely. A big one? The biggest one. <laughs> okay, you're up now. <clears throat> Listen to music and bomb. This is something I would do. Huh? I didn't realize you 
would enjoy crying over something. It's not all about the crying. It's about listening to music or reading a book and feeling something so strong that it moves you. Have you ever felt something like that before? I haven't been moved by reading or listening to something in a while, actually. What's next, Raya? Throw a party? What sort of party? Not sure, but we're going to have so much fun. You can do the next one. Collect all five letters of Yo Man. Beat the future fighter high score. I I am like literally avoiding the future fighter high score. The last like two options. I'm kind of like I would do it, but I'm not sure how hard or how easy this future fighter is. Collect all five letters of Yo Man. I'm gonna do it. I'm just gonna add it to my bucket list. Let's see. I guess I'll challenge myself. Future Fighter? Yeah, it's my favorite arcade game. It's not, it's notoriously hard to beat the high score. So there's gonna be a challenge then. Oh, good luck with that hero. What's next? Launch some fireworks. Bright lights dancing in the dark. Aren't they romantic? Yeah, I love the smell when they burn. Now your turn. Oh, this is... I... So I literally had to do all of them regardless of whether I skip it or not. <laughs> Collect all five different letters of Yeoman. Oh, that bubble gum brand? Each wrapper contains a letter from the word Yo Man, right? Are you that keen to collect them? They say if you gather all the letters, you get a grand prize. What's the grand prize? A bike. Can you ride a bike? No. Makes sense. Literally the same. <laughs> Pretty much what I just kind of... Raya is me. <laughs> I mean, the thrill is in collecting the letters. <laughs> if you say so. Is there anything else to add to our bucket list? I can't think of anything special. Special? Hmm. How about we make the last one on our list? Something like this. Find some precious treasure. What treasure? It's mysterious. That's what makes it special. Oh, it would be great if we could present this list for the future consultation. <laughs> Why the long face? It feels, it feels like when high school ends, the whole world might go with it. Ugh, I don't want to think about it, this stupid consultation thing. How about we do something from the list right now? Now, as in right now? Yeah, it'll be fun, come on. For your girlfriend, please. Okay, what do you want to do? It's been a while since we went to the movies together. Yes, let's skip the future consultation. Skip school, Miss Ag Agong. Agong said, just said, you are a model student. I'm a model student, not a slave. I want to skip school once in a while. Well, if you say so, come on. I'm looking forward to skipping the consultation session. You skip classes now and then, Atma. So, how do you do this? class skipping thing. First, by not announcing it loudly. Yes. Okay, now what? Grab your bag. We're out of here. We're going to walk straight out. Yes, be confident about it. And, okay. Oh. Oh. Hey, wait for me. Best place to sleep is is there anything in here? 
The shelf is clean, but the desk is full of little drawings of snails. A clean desk. Books neatly arranged. And a bottle of mineral water. That's Raya for you. And is that a pet plushie? Some empty snack wrappers. Hey, what's that limited edition fizzy drink? Darn it, it's empty. What is that? See that sparkle? So a notebook and a sun block. You can block the sun. Umbrella in a bottle? Yes. SPF is your best friend. Oh! Paloa Cola World Cup Edition. Very sporty looking. Raya go. She's surprisingly fast. What's this? Ouch. Ow, what the? Huh? Crap, I crashed into someone. I'm sorry, are you hurt? I'm... I'm fine, thank you. Are you okay? Fine, I guess. Oh, look, you dropped your book. Huh? It's a red book! At my end, this isn't my book. At my, huh? Strange. It's not mine either. Wait. Somehow, I feel like I've seen this book before. Yeah, that's a diving book. What do you mean? Was it in my dream? I'm not sure. Your name is on the cover. What? Atma, that's you, right? Yeah, but how? Are you sure it's not yours? Let's see. If I remember correctly, I only brought the clothes. I'm wearing my glasses and my hairband. I didn't bring any books. All of mine are still in the library. Maybe somebody else dropped it? Maybe you borrowed this note from your friend? This, maybe you borrowed this book. It first said note. Unless I was crazy. This book from your friend? Nonsense. All my friends already went home, and I never borrowed notes because I always write my own during class. Saying you don't own this book is an interesting statement. The book is, objectively, a real object. It has your full name on it, but you don't believe your own. You, you own it? Maybe you have short-term memory. Loss. It's usually caused by a violent impact to the head. But I was walking from the schoolyard to the library at moderate speed. Crashing into a girl much weaker than you wouldn't cause you any head trauma. If it's not a memory loss, you're either delusional or... You're lying. <laughs> I... I'm sorry. Sometimes I talk too much. You don't say. <laughs> All I'm saying is that the most possible situation is that you own the book, even though you don't remember it, Atma. Hmm. Okay. Wait, you know my name? We're in the same class. You don't remember? Huh? Really? You're always asleep. The fact that you don't know me isn't surprising. It's still rather rude. This girl. Is she looking down on me? Nonsense. I know you. You are. Um, classmate. Hey, you. You don't know, do you? No, I don't. Sorry. May I know your name? My name is Marin. I'm Atma. I know that. <laughs> well, I've got to go. Take care of your book, Atma. But it's not... Dot, dot, dot. Well, I mean, sure. It's the diving book. What is this book? I don't remember seeing what's written inside in my dream. A little peek won't hurt anybody, right? Objectives. The owner of this book must be a determined person unlike me. <laughs> oh, well, this is a good place to keep the bucket list I made with Raya. I feel motivated already. 
A map! Someone drew a map of Aloka City. Looks neat too. Inventory. Maybe I could write down what I have in my possession since I'm a little forgetful. A list of collectibles, huh? And I can stick photographs next to them. Does that mean I can take photos? This is the nice way to preserve precious memories. Huh, strange. There's a lot of missing pages in this section. Meow Princess, that's like, that was from the prologue. The pages have been torn out. I don't know whether Marin was right or not. Maybe it had something to do with the nightmare stream I had. I guess it doesn't hurt to keep a notebook around. I could even use the power in my dream with this. Lame joke. This is real life after all. Tab to open book. Oh, QE. Cool. I'm gonna have to learn the key bindings for this. What's this? Examine. So you know, wet paint. Do not cross. Okay. Go go, Raya. Where are you? <clears throat> Has she already left? I see a cat. How dare you try to skip af the afternoon class. Crap. No, we're not. We're just, you know, going to the toilet, sir. Yes, Mr. Agong and... Yes, Mr. Agong. And looking for snacks. You all know why you have to attend the afternoon class, don't you? For your own good. But other kids skip it, too. Shh, you moron. <laughs> What? And you let them leave? You're all so young. Have you ever thought about what your future might be if you spend your youth like this? Do you know who else like to skip classes? Corrupt officials. You want me to end? You want to end up as embezzlers? Go to jail? Disappoint your parents? I mean, I technically skip classes all the time back in high school. I think I turned out okay. Afternoon classes are just glorified detention. I can hear you. Eek! Well, I can't leave school through the gate. Hearing Mr. Agong wailing like a banshee is enough to drive anyone away. I should find another way. Let me pet this cat, though. Pet, pet. Oh! I can, I can name the cats. I'm gonna call it Wobbly. So cute. Can I talk to these people? Did you hear about Eric and his friends? What is it? Sometimes it skips school by climbing the wall behind the cafeteria. Damn, that's pretty ballsy. How the conversations going? Oh, I thought maybe I could talk to the students. I guess not. I gotta go to cafeteria. Hello. Who are you? Did you hear about the librarian removed all the comic books from the library? What a party pooper. Comic books are literature too. Agreed. What's in here? It's locked. Okay. Oh no! Who is that? Grr, kids these days don't care about their future. Where's that Emma? He won't escape. Not this time. I actually don't know why I talk like that. Why are teachers looking for me? I have to be careful. If I'm careful, I could sneak past the teachers behind this wall. It's worth a try. I'm so scared. This guy is moving his head too fast. Pop 
could he not see me behind this wall? Bro, like my face is my head is literally poking out. Oh, I did it. Oh, there's another one. Is Oh, it is a teacher. I thought it was maybe a student. Can I walk while they're just looking around? Until they do like that. <gasps> what is this? Solid snake time? I wish I knew that earlier. It's over here. I can't go through there. Kitty cat! Have we ever met kitty cat? Juno! Looks like a Juno. Okay, can I- oh. Who's this? Hey! Hey Emma, want to join our club? What club? Well, cough. No mountain is too tall. And no cliff too steep to stop our adventure. We are the hiking club. Can I lay down and read books in the mountains? Not if I have to do that spile, spile, every time I meet somebody. I guess like that motto. This one. Haha, <laughs> you're a shy one, I see. No need to be shy about loving mountains and nature. Yeah, sure. If only you could see us in action, we would entice you with the very art of the climb. Why can't I? You can show me right now. It's the new guy. He keeps missing our practice to sleep, of all things. He has our climbing equipment. It's a disaster. I told you it was a bad idea to give the new guy inventory duty. Oh, that's it. Let me grab this. Classic Cola Cola. Only 500 per bottle. Let's see if I have to climb over to the way of climbing. Some tools. How do I get but then that means I have to Oh now this is oh no it's not open. But where would they where would this stuff? Places that I could go to. Uh -huh. Oh, this opened. edition of Catch Me, I'll Hit You, an installment in the popular Wu Plus series. These books are surprisingly interesting. Suddenly I could go 
for some gum. She and the Light Bearer. I had this picture book as a child. It has a talking potato in it. I wouldn't eat my fries for months afterwards. World Atlas. Wait, someone put a note with blue ink in it. All these countries to visit, but all I want is to explore our future together. That is adorable. <laughs> hey, you. Hey, remember me? Haha, ha, very funny. Marin, right? Is this this guy? You don't mind if I borrow this rope, right? Thanks, man. Hello, viewers. Back again with the hottest gossip show in the country. The mysterious comet could be seen in the sky yet again last night at around 9 p.m. Weren't they talking about a comet in the dream or whatever? What could this comet be? And more importantly, what is the universe trying to tell us? Today, we're joined by the best psychic in the country to help us decode the truth. Right after this commercial. Hmm. Okay, so I got the stuff. All right, <clears throat> I got what I came for. The teachers were gone. Sweet. They randomly disappeared. Oh, there's more people here. Hello. The cafeteria was crowded. Oh, this is the cafeteria. It's outdoors. Some things were even sold out. But just like usual, the amount of food remaining and the money we made don't add up. Slippery kids. Oh, so people were stealing. Let's see. Hello! Nothing beats using a rope to climb over a wall to skip school. Yeah, I did it! Now I have to go find Raya. <laughs> that was unexpectedly difficult. Maybe I should consider joining that climbing club. But I'm out of school. Now I have to meet up with Raya. Oh, what's this? Old man's grape concoction. Is this one alcoholic? Oh, what's this? Nowadays people throw things away without care in the world. True. This old roof tile looks sturdy enough. Can I take it? No? Okay. I don't know, maybe I thought I could use it for something. Who are these people? Where do you think you're going? Shoo! That's rude. I guess I can't go there. <gasps> I see a cat. Now sit! He's not listening to me today. What's going on, boy? You've been restless all day. Whimper. Kitty cat! Hey, I've never seen you before. Cherry Warlord. I'm gonna call him Warlord. Cute. You're fluffy as always, Warlord. So I wonder if you like keep petting them. Does a special interaction like take place? Like, can you adopt them? <laughs> can they follow you around? Or is it just like a one time thing where you can just like give them names. Hey, Atma. Hello. Mr. Agong was looking for you and your lady friend. Oh. Yeah, don't worry. I won't tell him you two are here on a date, smooching and everything. That's a colorful way to put it. But thank you. There's a lot of students out here. Oh, what's in here? Huh? There's a torn envelope in here. The letter is nowhere to be found. From... 
Set Setiawan to Siri. Well, the stamp is still intact. Don't mind if I do. I'm assuming these are like collectibles. Oh, E. Oh, so I don't take photos. It just kind of shows up. Oh, here's the bottle caps. Okay. Tab. Oh, there she is. There you are. You took way too long. I had to take a detour, you know? The teachers launched a manhunt to find me. You shouldn't be surprised. Skipping school is all about the thrill, right? But still, you took way too long. How long have you been waiting? How did you manage to get out of school so fast? That's a very frail cat, not to mention skinny. This one. I'm gonna do this one. I had my way. Maybe I'm talented at skipping school. Meow. You agree as well, huh? Good kitty. Her. Hey, why don't we buy some cat food for her? I don't have money. Where can I buy cat food? All oh, right, I forgot you bought five packs of fried rice during break this morning. <laughs> you always say that you can't resist the smell of them frying the garlic. Mm. I love, I love fried rice, especially when there is garlic, onions, eggs, corn. Now I want fried rice. <laughs> Do I? You do. Ha ha ha. Typical Atma. Where can I buy cat food? I heard Carunia de Dejaya's de general store has everything. Let's check there first. Well, I bought the money. Why don't you check your pocket? You might have some coins left. I told you I don't have any. That's strange. Did you see the screen get all weird? Whoa, you're right. I've still got some money. How deep is this pocket? Moral of the story, always listen to your girlfriend. Am, is this a dream? Am I in like a dream world? Like, is a prologue what happened IRL and then I drown and then like this is like I'm in a coma or something? Is this like what's happening right now? Because that was just really weird. Like the screen twitching like that. Hold that thought. Of course, you're the smart one here. Meow. Look, she's hungry. Let's check the general store. Yes, ma'am. I got new objectives. Oh. She going with me? What's this? That's a lot of. That is a lot of a. Uh, Lin Tang Festival. Prepare for the best Lin Tang Festival ever. That was a lot of money. I'm assuming it's a lot of money. I could be wrong. Let me know in the comments below if, like, you know how much that equals to dollar amount. What kind of festival is this? Come on, let's get the cat food for her. Oh, there's a lot going on here. It's been a while since this movie was shown at the cinemas. The poster was worn has worn away. Alright. So before we go get the cat food, I think I'm going to stop it here. Um, I do want to thank you guys for staying with me so far. I want to know what your guys' thoughts are, what theories you guys have, because clearly I'm already coming up with little theories. I don't exactly know what is going to unfold, but I'm really excited of how the story, the character development is going to proceed as we dive deeper into the game. Also, let me know if you guys have played this game. Did you guys finish it? Where are you at in the gameplay and what your thoughts are? So until then, see you guys next time. Bye!